Hey guys, so we are currently at Putabberg here in the province of Pechabun and we are on top of a mountain and there are lots of resorts like bungalows, igloo tents, dome tents, teepees right there We traveled here from Khao Kha for about an hour, 50, actually 50 minutes if you really be want to be more accurate. So this is the resort that we are staying in. The weather is so cool. So let's go and check out the surroundings. So each uh, cabin has got a viewing area on top of the uh, cabins like this one. So if you come here to Putaburg during the weekdays, not so many people and it's more convenient to go around as there's less traffic. But definitely on the weekends, this place here is packed with tourists. And we paid for the place at, we paid 1,500 for the place. And with free breakfast buffet. So this is just outside the resort we are staying at and you can already see some shops small shops selling sweaters sweatpants and other clothing for cool weather Here they've got Japanese scrape for sale. And also has some mong bag, mong dresses. These are the traditional mong dresses. So the pattern is like this here at Puthaburg. This shop, these two shops are still closed. Lots of produce they're selling. They have like Bohima. It's a 100 per pack. Uh, 100 per pack. And they have like a tamarind, pansi tong. These are sweet tamarinds. And they've got candies from China as well. Melons, avocados, some almond nuts here, and dried strawberries. And there's also wine, strawberry wine. Been, ah, so they have got lots of wines from grapes and strawberries and other produce. Right here, there's a car. by do kind of so. So candy. These are candy from China. Apples, huge ones. So basically, they're selling almost the same thing. And these are the fresh produce that they harvested from here at Putaburg. So nice little carrots here, some peas, green peas, cabbages, I don't know what these are, beetroot here, yeah, so they're actually harvested from here at Putaburg. They have some pumpkins right there, chayotes, 
and ginger big ones oh look at those they've also got some sweet potatoes also some wine Look, these carrots are so small. They're very small. Ten baht per. per uh, and strawberries. They're selling it for 160 and 300 if you buy two. So the stores are selling almost the same thing. So if you go from one store to another, you'll see basically almost the same thing. So there's a viewpoint right there. We're going to check that out later. So remember that it's the weekday. So expect not to see the crowds who are coming in from the cities. So just a few people are here, few tourists. And if you come here on the weekends, definitely expect a heavy traffic of people and vehicles as well. And here they're just actually delivering the uh, produce, sweet potatoes. Look at this. Right here. Sweet potatoes. ไม่เป็นไรเพิ่งมาครับเดี๋ยวดูรับๆก่อนครับครับอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอีกอ
นี่คือภาษาอะไรและถ้าคุณสังเกตเห็นบางคนพูดภาษาที่ชาวบ้านพูดเขาเรียกว่าภาษาเมืองแมงคุดเป็นหนึ่งในภาษาที่ใหญ่ที่สุดของภาษาเมืองแมงคุดในภาษาทะเลอินเดียเขาเรียกว่าเมืองแมงคุด So sometimes you might hear some people talking that you might notice it's not Thai, it's Hmong language. So basically that's it guys for the market tour here at p u t a p u t Pechabun province. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.